Hey guys, it's TJ here. I want to talk to you today about your goals and, and where you are now versus where you want to be and the difference in life and what has to happen for you to achieve this. Now, what we have in life, guys, is standards. And these standards actually keep us where we are. The people around us have standards. We have standards. Now, these standards are, if you look at your body and you may be you know, 15 kilos overweight, 30 pounds overweight, 20 kilos overweight, that's because of your standards. Your standard is you're happy to be overweight. Your standard is you're happy you don't have to exercise. Your standard is you're happy to eat the wrong foods or eat too much of the foods or not get the knowledge you need in your standards, guys. So what you have to look at is if you need to get the body you want, you have to raise your standards. You have to you know, live by a set of standards that is completely different. So with your standards you currently have right now, what you have to understand is a standard is a matter of a set of rituals. So your standards you live every day is you, you might be, you don't want to go to bed early, or maybe you're happy to wake up and, and indulge in a, in a big breakfast every morning and, and keep eating it. It's a ritual that you live by. Your ritual is to press snooze and not go and train. A ritual is to say you're stressed and not do go, go like go, go to the gym after work. Now, these rituals that we have every single day inside our life. They, they, that's what makes our standards. Now, the standards of an elite performer, right? The standards of someone who's an elite athlete. What do you think their standards are? What do you think their rituals are made up by? Do you think the rituals they have are they're going to press snooze on their alarm? Or do you think they're actually going to get their workout in? Do you think they fuel their body for performance? Or do you think they just eat whatever they want? We all want the, the body of an athlete, except we don't want to have the rituals of the of the athlete we want to have our own standards which kept us where we are so guys a bit of an enlightenment moment for you the rituals that brought us where we are today i'm going to grab one thing for jackson the rituals that brought us where we are today i want you to write those down so what standards have you been living by what rituals have you had that have taken you to the point where you are right now whether it be business or fat loss so you had rituals every day or every weekend they actually sabotaged your results. Maybe you overindulged on the weekend and that was your ritual. Or you do it at the movies and that was your ritual. And that sabotaged your whole week's fat loss. Or your ritual was pressing snooze. Or your ritual was making an excuse and not getting that workout in. And now I want you to look at where do your standards need to be? So standards can come from obviously with you and you need to change your standards. But also they come from the fact that guys, you need to have people around you with good standards. Your community needs to have great standards. The people you're training with needs to have great standards. Your coaches need to have great standards. You need someone to push you to have better standards. And this is where you get the standards from. Because if everyone around you has amazing standards and <laughs> they have the body of their dreams, it's only a matter of time that you lift your standards up, get the body of your dreams. And with these standards, guys, I want you to also have a look at like what rituals you need to put into your life what do you need in your life guys to actually achieve that body so do you need to wake up and train in the morning is that a ritual you need to start do you need to prepare your meals the day before do you need to say your gratitude every single day do you need to you know get a new group of friends you train with to lift your standards is that a ritual that you need so we have rituals that take us away from the standards we want the body we want the life we want we have rituals that take us towards the body we want the standards we need and the life we want. So, guys, there's two columns. You fill out A, took you where you are. Fill out B, take you where you need to be. And just live by those rituals every single day. At the start, it's going to take willpower, right? It takes willpower to initiate new rituals in your life. Every single day for the first 30 days, it's going to take willpower. But once that willpower sort of, they become habits, you don't have to think about them anymore. It just comes a part of life. There are rituals in your lifestyle. Your body's going to start to change. Your life's going to start to change. And you have everything you want. And that's how you achieve your goals in life. And that's it from, from me and little Sleepy Jacks. Hope you have a fantastic day, guys. And I'll talk to you soon.